Hi there, everybody, and welcome to this group stage match where the stakes are high, Alan. They are, and when in tournament play, it's all about uh, consistency of performance and very much a question of concentration. I think it will be here. I think the women's game now running in tandem with the men's game with all the different competitions, European Championships, World Cups. It's a very exciting development and there's no doubt that the standards are going up with the intensity of the competition. And I think the players involved, what they would be encouraged by is the fact that the crowd seem to be getting bigger and the profile on television, in the media, has increased over the years. There's no doubt as broadcasters we get invited to cover women's tournaments as much as men's tournaments now, which would never have happened 20, 25 years ago. Yeah, I mean, I think the level of competition in these tournaments now makes it more appealing to a worldwide audience, you might say. Here's the lineup. Well, more often than not, we're looking at teams that shape up this way, Alan. Yeah, such a popular system. 4 2 3 1. It gives you a lot of stability, and if your front four, as you might describe them, are good players, it's a really potent system. This is the lineup. So, Alan, 4 4 2. Yeah, I think it looks that way, Martin. Yes, it's the conventional shape, it's the one that the manager prefers. It's not true that they closed down the old Wembley, Alan, at your request, because it was the only place you ever got a yellow card in your professional career. No, uh, well, it was a famous old stadium. Oh, it's, it was a cliché, but it was a sapping surface as well uh, on the grass. Nowadays, on the new Wembley pitch, it's not quite the same, more like Premier League pitches here. And the woman in charge today is Nia Jokalainen. Second match, match day two, in the group stage of this competition. Yeah, already we've seen some fireworks in this competition and uh, maybe a few more to come. Now Andresinia. To Greenwood. Aluko. Could be danger. The shot's on. Good work by the goalkeeper. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. Knobs. That's an easy interception because the pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Here's Monica. Monica. To Alves. Now Andresinia. Got on the ball in midfield, well read by player in that part of the pitch here's Jill Scott if the opposition back off they could be in trouble and the ball gets to here that's neatly done and here's the shot great save by a diving goalkeeper corner Fist away by the keeper. Shot on. Well, 
as blocks go. That's a good one. Now Houghton! Fabiana. Good forward play from them. Now Marta. Williams. Here's Williams. Confident and quality on the ball. Well, it's out for a corner. Not a good corner at all. Well, it's a chance, isn't it, to put the team under pressure, but they've just wasted that chance completely. And that is uh, a chance again. Let's have a quick look at it. We can squeeze it in, the save. Oh, there's nothing like seeing a top-class save like that. Well, now they've won the ball back in the middle of the park by intercepting that pass. Here's Williams. Carney. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. Good play, but they've lost the ball now. And the opposition can get at them. Here's a Luco, able to make a good interception. To Alves. Well, the defender has uh, made the attacker actually make that error, it's out of play. It's Jill Scott now. Here's Williams. Carney. Aluko on the attack here. And that will clear the danger. They've gone up to take the throw well up the field, keep the pressure on. Luco to Carney to Marta. Added time coming up. There will be two minutes of it to Tamires. Rafael. Here's Pollyanna. Well, that is half time, and the score is nil nil here. Here we're going to have a substitution. It seems as though it's for tactical reasons. Here we go into the second half of this second match in the group stage. Looking forward to it. It was uh, quite a closely run affair, so uh, I wonder if that will continue in this second half. Here's Rafael. Monica. Now Fabiana. Possession in the midfield area. To Carney. Aluko. Successful tackle. Substitution imminent now. Good vision to be able to switch the play there. It's Jill Scott now. That's a turnover to the opposition. It's a great understanding here. And the cross coming in. And it is a goal kick. Backup brigade is going to have a chance centre stage.
Here's Jill Scott. Here's Duggan. Goalkeeper hangs on. Duggan. And the ball's gone again. Now Marta. Stoney. Well, they're back defending and they've cut the pass out there. And maybe that will ease the pressure. Here's Duggan. Here's the cross. Danger was looming large. They've got themselves back on the ball and they can attack themselves now. Well, it's been uh, stopped the play now and the booking is going to happen. She's got a yellow card. Yeah, she's not complaining too much. Holds her hands up. She knows she was guilty there. Flashes wide. Oh, she's gone for the corner and not missed it by much. Now they've won the ball back and trying to make something of it quickly. Duggan. Away long. To Greenwood. Farrow Williams. Now the shot! At full extension, the goalkeeper makes the save. You look at the opposition and almost the belief is flowing out of them. They don't think they can beat this keeper between the sticks. Rosanna. Pollyanna. Formiga. Alves. Here's Tysa. Now Marta. There's a passing game. And my word, they're passing it well here. Well, here comes the substitution now. Now Duggan. Well, just over 84 minutes gone. Six minutes left on my watch. Pollyanna. is in and south of danger there with that clearance brilliant technique in the tackle to Carney Duggan Carney It's finished level as the referee blows the whistle for the last time. Well, possession wasn't everything today because the team with less of the ball managed to get a draw from this. Yeah, the possession isn't always nine-tenths of the law. They didn't take the chances and uh, they go away disappointed.
save. 